What's going on everybody? It's your boy coming at you with another ranked match against the hated heat. I said I'm gonna use the Golden State Warriors. I mean the Golden State Warriors, they have a lot of shooters and that's what I like. I love to shoot. And uh, not only do they have shooters, they do have Andrew Bogut down in the post. So I'm gonna try to get something going with him and not only that, they have David Lee. So I mean this is a, a pretty much a complete team that you can play with. I mean, I feel like I can run with this team against anybody on here. You can see I'm right here. That's just a play going down into the light-skinned dude, Stephen Curry. But um, I feel like I can take this team and go against anybody. And I really didn't. I felt confident going against the Heat. And plus, you know, I feel like my defense is on point this year. So I'm not really worried about LeBron at all. You see right here, he gets the gold 10. David Lee is telling him to go ahead and count that. And I mean, uh, man, I'm just, I'm loving 2K when it works. You know, because you still have the things that's going on in 2K as far as online, man. You never, listen, AI. Eagle Dollar knocking down that two, that long two-pointer. But you just look at the video, man. Just look at the on-ball D that we play. I mean, he's going to try to isolate LeBron a couple times, but I'm going to meet him right at the rim. Look at this block. Get that shit out of here, LeBron. He tried to bring that down there so we can get it out. Get it down into Andrew Iguodala. He misses it. David Lee gets the rebound, backs it up, and knocks down that jumper. See, somebody else probably would have tried to pull that shot back up, but I said David Lee has a very good mid-range, so I might as well just go ahead and back it up a little. And LeBron comes back down and knocks down that leaning three. That looks just like his shot, though. He do lean on his three-pointer. But uh, as much as I hate LeBron, man, I, I always give him his his props, man, because the dude is a beast. Uh, you can't deny the beast that LeBron James is. So even though I hate LeBron, but I respect him as a player because the dude can do anything on the court. And so you see right here, we missed this uh, shot right here. He's getting it down into the break. Dwayne Wade has the ball, gets it down into LeBron in the corner, and he knocks down that baseline jumper. So. See right here, he's doubling, trying to isolate LeBron. We get the rebound, which run. You always want to run on this team because, you know, and this is just sloppy by me. You're going to see me turn the ball over like two times right here. I'm going to turn the ball over again right here, not slowing down. You want to run, but you also want to play smart. And that's not what I'm doing. So he gets his ball down into Jesus Shuttlesworth. He knocks down in three. So I'm like, shit, you know, it's, it's not looking too good right now. I don't want to go down against this team. It's coming down to the end of the uh first quarter but it's still you know we're right there with him you know he only has to lead by two you know happy thanksgiving to everybody you know now that i'm seeing the effects of thanksgiving that 2k has provided for the video i did play this game today earlier so happy thanksgiving to everybody that's out there hope y'all having a good one and stuffing yourself as much as you need to you're gonna pay for that shit later on today or in the morning when you got to take your ass to work, you got the bubble guts, you know, the BGs, you stomach going to be rumbling and bubbling, you got to go to the, well, we're going to get off for all that, but you see right here, he just goes to rack strong, man, and I have my bench in right now, and I like this uh, Baze more, dude, I really didn't know him, uh, but I've been hearing about him lately, but uh, the Baze more guy, he's pretty good, man. Y'all let me know who he is, because, you know, I, I mean, I pay attention to the Lakers real heavy. I'm a real big NBA fan, but I'm not going to sit here and lie and just tell you I know about every every player that plays in the NBA, what college they went to. I don't play that, you know, that close to other teams. You know, I'm right there with the Lakers, and that's what I'm really paying attention to. But I do watch other NBA games, but it's a lot of people that, you know, I just don't really just know about their rookies and I'm not into all that, you know, a lot of people are into knowing what rookies doing and, and you know, the first round draft pick and the first picks to go in the NBA, I really don't give a shit, I just want to know what my Lakers doing, you see David Lee put that put back back and we tied the game right there, so I mean, we're looking good, but I know we can look a whole lot better and I mean, just look at the scoreboard. I think this is the best scoreboard in an NBA game ever. I love 2K14's Next Gen scoreboard. That scoreboard is just, it, it's, man. That, I love the scoreboard. I always said I wanted either an ESPN scoreboard, but you know, Whack Ass Live took the license for that, so I knew we couldn't get the, the ESPN scoreboard. So right there, he just leave me open. Stephen Curry, like, how you gonna leave Stephen Curry open? So I went ahead and took that three and dropped him off. We couldn't get the ESPN scoreboard. I said, if we can't get the ESPN shit, I'll even take the TNT. But I guess they couldn't like that up. But 2K, you know, the scoreboard for the current gen, that shit is terrible. 
But looking at this scoreboard now, I think it's a major upgrade. You see right here, we're taking our time, bringing it out with Stephen Curry. We're just dribbling the ball around right now. We're not calling the play, just trying to get somebody open, get it down into Bogut. He has a foul. I mean, that's a mismatch down there. I'm going to fast forward through that, but it was a mismatch down there. We played real good here on the possession before. So you see right here, we, we, you have to watch out for that because it seems like it's automatic. When guys take the ball out and they're behind a three-pointer, you give them any type of space, you know, at least 80% of the time it will go in. So you want to hold, you know, the guy that's sitting behind the three-point line. And I'm calling this play right here. Get it out to Andrew Bogut. Andrew Bogut goes into the post, get it back out to Curry. Curry goes down for the layup. The play was intentionally for Curry, but I went away from the play, but I went back into the play. And you see it worked out as we uh went to the seven points in the game. Went to the rack and got that uh, easy layup. I want to say easy layup. I really don't know how he didn't get that block. But you see right here, we're playing real good D. Clay Thompson has the ball on break, and he lays the ball up. So we're playing real good defense. We stand in front of LeBron. Just look at the on-ball defense, man. I mean, we'll stand in front of LeBron. We're doing a very good job. Stand in front of, the, you know, the best player and the, the most strongest player as far, you know, that's not a power forward or a center, you know, so we're doing pretty good right now. We're going to the half up by four. So we take the lead now. Everything is looking good. I'm proud of my team and what we're doing. We are playing against the strongest team in the NBA and shit on 2K also. You know, the Heat, if you know how to use them, they can be pretty unbeatable. So I'm looking to play with the Heat later on. That's probably going to be my next game because I don't even think I ever bought a ranked match to y'all. Maybe I have. I know it, has, it can't be more than one right there. It's Dwayne Wade going in strong for the and one smash. But it's probably been one that I brought, but I haven't really played with the Heat. I want to play with the Heat, you know, and just show you how you're really supposed to use them. But look at this right here. Playing real, just, you know, slowing our pace now. Get it down into carry again. I don't know how we get that shot up, but we do get that layup to go. Everything is looking good. He has a call a timeout. Curry's gonna go to his big man, you know, to, you know, Andre Iguodala, give him the handshake, let him know everything is good. And right here, LeBron James, he misses the free throw. You know what happens out the free throw. If they miss a free throw, you have to run the break and try to get an easy shot. So we get it with Iguodala. Iguodala can get it out to Stephen Curry in the corner. Stephen Curry knocks down at three, man. So anytime they miss a free throw, you hurry up and just run the break. That's what you're supposed to do. So we hit the Wayne Wade has ball. Give me back out to Chalmers. We putting the body weight on him. And that's another thing that you notice, man. You notice the body weight in the game. Like you just can't pass by and just get by anybody. You see, but Dwayne Wade, he's playing like himself right now because Dwayne Wade is having a pretty good year so far. But uh I think he's gonna miss his free throw. But you can tell in the uh in the game, man, the body weight, it actually accounts for something, man. It, 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 Man, I don't know. It, the, the game, it plays good, man. It, it is a lot of flaws in the game, but this game is damn near perfect if you take away, you know, the online problems right here. That's Bazemore. That's, is that Bazemore? I don't know who the hell that is. I think that's Bazemore, man, but I was saying I like that guy a lot. But uh, he throws up the shot. I didn't play good defense right here, and that's Mario Chalmers dropping me off from three to end off the third quarter. We could have gone into the fourth up by, by six, but we go in by three, so uh, that's – Harrison Barnes, he pumping this fist. He glad that his team had at least has a lead against the uh, Heat going into the fourth. So, 38-35. We're still up right now. So, we're going to the fourth. We get the ball back right here. We'll make something happen on the first possession. But as I was saying, man, you can tell the, the body weight in the game. You know, it. no matter who you are, even if you are LeBron and how strong you are, you still can stop somebody, you know, if you get in front of them. Because that's what's supposed to happen. LeBron is... Not even though you have a point guard in front of him right here, that's Bays more again, knock it down to three. But uh, but uh, even if you have a point guard, you know, in front of LeBron, he's still going to you know back the shot or back the uh. I'm trying to hold up. Let me see what's going to happen right here. That's yeah, this right here again. Just good D right there. That's what I mean right there. That was just good, a good defensive stop. And what I mean, and uh, you know, and people that's in front of LeBron, no matter who's in front of him, he he gonna have to bring it back out. He just can't just run through everybody like there's nobody there. 
other guys as a sniper. You know, like NBA Live 14, you can just turbo pass anybody and go into the paint and knock down the shot. So it's nothing like that in uh, 2K14, especially in next gen. It's right here. And I, I try to call a play, but the play never material. I'm like, what's going on with the play? So we have to hurry up and just pull a shot up. You probably want to rewind that, but I called the play the floppy base like three times, and the play did not develop on the court where we were supposed to run everything. And I just had to pull up a, a shot with Curry. Thankfully, he made it. Right here, LeBron just dribbling the ball, and he gets past me. And he goes in. We didn't close out early enough on that, but it's all good. We still have the lead right now. We're about four. They has ball. He pulls up the shot. Missed the ball, get an offensive rebound, get it out the... Nah, he's not hitting. So LeBron is just not unstoppable in this game. You see we running the break right now. Well, we tried to run the break. Bring it out. We're trying to get him to the post. But look what, look what happens. He's going to leave Steph Curry open while I get him in the post. Get it back out to Steph Curry. He knocks down that three. Stephen is knocking him down right now, man. Everything is looking good for my team, man. That was a very big three. That's like a momentum changer right there. We're up by eight at this point. And you see right here, that's uh, that's Dwayne Wade going in for a, another strong layup. Can't get mad because that's how, you know, Dwayne Wade is playing right now. So right here we get it out to Clay Thompson. This is a floppy, a floppy base play, but it doesn't work. Curry going to pull up the shot. He doesn't make it. We get the offensive rebound. Bogey gets the rebound and put it right back up. So we're still up by eight, man. I mean, we're finishing the game out strong. I mean, if I, if, I feel like if I'm up by eight, two minutes into the game, there's no way I'm going to give the lead up. You see right here LeBron going to go in for a smash. Just run over everybody. And LeBron can do that. But uh, right here he fouls me. I'm going to go in for my two points. But uh, that pretty much the end of the game, man. And we go ahead and close this game out strong. It's not easy playing against the Heat, man, against somebody that really knows how to use him. I give credit to this guy. He did not just try to go in. I mean, he did isolate with uh, LeBron and Dwayne Wade a lot, but he did not try to go in and cheese a whole lot. So I give a whole lot of credit to my opponent. But Steph Curry, he's the player of the game. Y'all give your boy a thumbs up. Give me a like, man, because these videos are taking a whole lot longer to render man it, it, it's a whole lot of work now since i switched over to the hdmi and the next gen so for all the hard work man y'all give your boy a thumbs up man leave me a like let me know y'all liking you know the content i'm bringing but i'm gonna you know sign out man y'all have a happy thanksgiving it's your boy shout dog